You're not gonna believe why this woman Joanne is internet famous. One day, back in the day, her parents buy this house and they love this house. It's in a quiet neighborhood. They create incredible memories there. But then one day, after 35 years of living there, it all changed. Some Hollywood producers approach her and they really like her house and they wanna film a TV show there. So they pay the family a bit of money and they let them film there. But then to everyone's surprise, that TV show, it ended up being a massive hit. In fact, you probably heard of it. <laughs> Now the show becomes so popular that the address to the house gets posted online. And of course, fans just start showing up, which might seem like a fun novelty, but then they start coming in droves. 24 7, 365, we have people, we get harassed. Nobody anticipated that. They take pictures of the house at all hours of the night. They trespass. They steal rocks from the landscaping as a souvenir. Some people even try and throw pizza on the roof because of that famous scene from the show. Yeah! Now Joanne, the daughter, she's the one who lives there now. And she's the one who has to deal with all this. I have total surveillance cameras around my property. I get attacked by drones. Yeah, and in response, she changed the way the house looks. She put a six foot wrought iron fence up around the front, but people still show up all the time. And Joanne, she doesn't put up with their nonsense. She lets them know they aren't wanted. Get out. You're a loser. The show's been over 10 years. Get a life. I don't give a sh why don't you sell it and then get it? Why don't a you buy one and sell yours? And now she's kind of internet famous. They call her Breaking Bad House Lady. And they claim she waits in her front yard for people to show up so that she can yell at them. She literally sits outside. <laughs> All right, we're leaving. Calm your and of course, at some point, influencers catch on to this. And now a lot of them show up there just to harass her. Who uh, are you? Daniel Mack. Who's I just asked him what they do for a living. Who the f is Daniel Mack? And all this got so bad that even Vince Gilligan, the creator of the show, had to come out and make a statement. Let me tell you, there is nothing original or funny or cool about throwing a pizza on this lady's roof. And of course, all this happened in Albuquerque, New Mexico, so shout out to New Mexico.